Good evening, LinkedIn. Um, James Smith, Smith and Son. It's been a real busy day for for the guys, uh, but I've landed back to my workshop tonight. It's uh, nearly eight o'clock, I believe, and uh, one of my rail customers has dropped me off a uh, Lindy valve segment and spool. Now the grab on the uh, machine's failed, and it's sent a lot of metal up to the uh, to the spool and damaged it. And it ain't the first time because we've done this quite a few times before. Now, I thought I'd post this video because um, I'm going to post this job on here and the LinkedIn uh, engineering place will be seeing the pictures of this thinking, Christ, these guys are cowboys. But I'm going to show you what I'm doing. So this, this, this is obviously where all the steel's been in here. It's trashed it in there and it's trashed the spool, which we're in the process of cleaning up right now. I've had to come up with some ideas and this is one of them. A flappy paddle on a piece of threaded uh, bar. That's been... Going in there with my drill, cleaning it up, plenty of lube on the job, going in the washing machine and getting washed and, and vice versa. This little creation with a piece of threaded bar, look, that's been getting the uh, the heaviest stuff out of there and it would have, it's getting uh, a bit cleaner now so I can keep, continue to use this one. That's where we started. You know, and that, it is working and this this is this is going to get uh, the machine back working again. I'm, uh, oh, and I'm going to enjoy this uh, lovely this lovely cookie. Um, but my reason for saying this is because Lindy don't have this part. The manufacturer for the machine in Germany doesn't have the part. So they can't give us a lead time. Also, the part is 9,000 quid. Which is pretty steep. But the main thing about above all that sort of stuff is my machine needs to uh, my, blue, my customer needs to be loading trains so i'm gonna do what it fucking takes to, <laughs> to get this to work and before people say oh you can't do that it's a precision fit it's a spool you know what i'm, I'm pretty i'm pretty aware of that i've been doing job 25 here but i'm gonna do what i need to do to get this machine to work and it'll work see you on monday <laughs> 